Okay, so my boat's getting long here. I've got all of this sanded down to the same height. There's a little bit of a wobble, so we'll have to figure out how to deal with that. Um, and I have got the deck sketched out for what needs to be cut out. I need to cut out this block for the stern wheel. Possibly this, depending on how I want to set up my servos and rotors. This is going to be the engine room. This is the cargo hold. This is the space that the boiler can go in because the bulkheads are here. The boiler will have to sit down on the hull. And then there will be the space on the nose here. And then the pilot's house will take up approximately this space here. Now, I had to remove about an inch or two from the cargo hold when I had started building this thing because I figured that it would be best since it's a model that the steam lines aren't the longest in the world. This is already, I'm betting, going to be pushing it for the length. I bet it'll condense before it hits these engines. But I can still wrap the steam lines in some kind of cotton cloth. And that will help. <clears throat> so the servo slash rudders will be going here, they'll go in this space. And as I can see, the bomb's already cut up to the angle, and the rudders will go out on the bottom here, probably protruding about that much. Still don't know how I'm going to finish this thing so it's watertight, but this is this so far. <laughs> 